Hey everyone, how are you? It's Michael. Uh, today I just wanted to do a quick video to show you some things that I have recently gotten in the mail um, and to talk to you about a new uh, paper craft card collaboration that I am doing with someone. Uh, but let me start with this. This is, um, this is the second postcard I've gotten from my friend Karen D'Angelo in New York. Um, I love her art, I love what she does. She does a lot of black and white and line drawings and very zentangle-ish, but she makes it her own. Um, and this is the second postcard that I've gotten from her and I feel really bad because I have yet to send her one. Um, and I really, I really need to do that. I need to do that soon. Um, Karen, it's coming, I swear. Um, something else that I got that really made my day. I, I sometimes get it every year, um, but you know, with the mail and stuff, I got uh, a Christmas, um, a Christmas photograph from um, my friend Mary, who I used to work with in New York. And when I worked for an attorney, we rented space in a, a bigger a bigger space and she was the office manager and honestly I think she's the, the only reason I enjoy going to work there there were some other people also I'm, I'm not gonna I'm not gonna be mean but Mary and I used to sit in her office and just um, talk and laugh and I really really miss her and getting these photographs every year at the holidays of course I get them like a month or two late because of the mail, but I, I've loved seeing how I remember her kids, and I think this is one of the earliest ones that I've had, so to see her kids go from this to this, and there are others others in here that um, I just, this really made my, my week, really. Um, her kids are beautiful. They've really, they've really turned out amazingly beautiful. But, you know, when you have amazing parents, you end up being an amazing kid. Um, like me. Uh, something else I ordered. Um, okay, so I know that this is going to piss off some people. Um, and let me say this. I, I do use AliExpress, okay? I don't, I don't use it for stamps or dies. Um, I really am really pissed off at the fact that AliExpress is allowed to just copy things that other companies are making and sell it as their own for, you know, one one hundredth of the price or something. But there are things that I have always bought from AliExpress, paper flowers, I buy sequins in bulk, I buy um, uh, things to make with shaker cards, I buy that in bulk. And something that I recently found uh, were stickers, some adhesives. And um, I don't know any company that's selling these. A million and a million and a one companies are selling these. So it's not like um, I can say, oh, these are so-and-so's images and I'm being illegal about it. I honestly 1,000% do not agree with buying anything on AliExpress if you know that they are being uh, copywritten from other companies. And the crafters out there know what I'm talking about. But so I got these um, adhesives. I, I don't really know what I'm gonna do with it. I actually do. I have this huge, um, I have a really old mannequin type thing here that's been, I found it in the garbage. And um, if I can figure out how to take a photo and insert it into this video, I'll do that. But um, I, always had this idea to use stencils on it and, and things like that. And then I started to see these, these stickers all over the place here. And I thought, oh, maybe I'll just cover it with stickers, but I don't know. So I got, I got this, this is like cats in, um, oh my God, cats in, cats in what? Just whimsical cats with coffee, cats and coffee, it seems. Um, I think I got this to send a few to my friend Deborah. I, I don't know, I'm a little confused. These are some Heartstopper um, adhesive stickers because Heartstopper is like, um, I'm saying I'm too much, I apologize. Heartstopper was a series that I watched on Netflix that just tugged at my heart and I thought it was the best thing ever done 
for the LGBT community ever. And they're coming out with a new season soon. And I'm hoping to find some Heartstopper papers so that maybe I can make uh, an album of some sort. So that's why I got this. I got rainbow stickers because one always needs rainbow stickers, don't we? Uh, these are, what were these? This was, I see Kwanzaa. These may have been for Kwanzaa. Uh, these are Kwanzaa stickers. And I got these because, you know, as you guys know, I am a crafty elf. So every month on the 25th, I uh, do a card collaboration with my friends, Deborah and Lisa and Misty. And we do holiday cards. And it's really hard to find. I do Hanukkah cards. I do Christmas cards. I do New Year's cards. It's really difficult to find images for Kwanzaa to use on cards. And especially stamps. But I, um, I looked on Etsy and I didn't really see a lot that I really liked. So I really love these stickers. And now I can get to make some Kwanzaa cards for the blog collaboration. This was some Halloween stickers that I got. Um, these are stickers of, I think, pit bulls because we have a pit bull. I just had to do that. These are more coffee stickers. Um, I am focusing here on coffee and books. So some of these are, are kind of cool. Just a girl who loves iced coffee. Well, I don't think Deborah likes iced coffee, so who wants that sticker? Uh, Hocus Pocus coffee. This will be great for Halloween. So I got these. I'm not a planner. I got these to hopefully make some fun cards with and to share some with, maybe use as a giveaway at some point. Uh, these are stickers. I think these were positive, positive like off affirmations or, or radiate positivity. We do, we do be vibin' dough. We, I don't know what that even means. Anyone know what that means? Um, I'm a straight man with gay pride. I kind of like that. <laughs> That's kind of cool. Uh, be the boss. It's funny, this company, they sell the stickers in either a quantity of 10, a quantity of 30, uh, or a quantity of 50. And I was a little concerned about buying 50 of everything, not knowing what they were like. So. I, some of these I only got a quantity of 10, just as a way to test the waters here. And these aren't bad, I'm really impressed. I thought they'd be bigger, but I, I'm okay with these. These were just some funny cartoony dogs. And considering I have many cartoony dogs, I, I figured I could use this for something. Um, more dogs. See the theme here? This, I actually don't remember what this is. I'll leave a link below to the store if you're interested. This, I, let's see. This was happy birthday. I don't remember buying these. Happy birthday. I'll have to go and check my, my kind of receipt here. I, happy birthday. I don't remember buying these. So uh, maybe these were... Maybe these were a gift, but heck, I will be able to use these. So I make birthday cards. It's fine. This was a, a bunch of LGBT stickers. Uh, I can use these for pride, and I can use these for what I will be discussing in five minutes with you guys. So love wins. I'm really big on, on this. The, the flag, the sunglasses. I am all for being positive and loving everyone. And then this, oh, these are books. This is, these are some stickers for book lovers, book readers, readers of books. Hello, I'm reading, go away. And the book was better, I always say this, oh my gosh. Um, just one more chapter, Deborah always says this. I'm sure a lot of us always say that. So these will be, Oh, this is a cute one. Look at that. Little giraffe holding the books. Cute. And I didn't think that there would be doubles, but there are doubles, but that's okay. 
That's like a look at this, a little cat reading a book. Maybe it's a cookbook, a foot, a fish cookbook. Um, cute, very cute. I apologize for the motorcycle, but that's my life here. And last but not least, I got a little surprise package from um, a friend of mine who is a, a card collaborator with me on The Crafty Elves. And she and I are gonna be doing another uh, collaboration. This is all from my friend Misty, who you guys may know as the Jolly Fat Elf. I will leave a link to her social media pages down below also. She does amazing videos on YouTube with card making and things like that. And she recently got into, I think she's gonna do things with clay now or how to make little clay things to use on cards, but go check her out. She sent me a handmade card. She And I love her holiday cards because she always uses non-traditional colors, which, um, I have issues dealing with. I just can't seem to do it. But this is really cool. It looks like it's peace and she um, inlaid the, the words, the, the letters into, into the word. That's kind of cool, using different colors and different patterns here. So very cool. She, um, she had posted on her Instagram account, uh, on her Facebook page, that a package she sent to Brazil was somehow in, I think it was Canada. And I did not make the connection that it was coming to me. I just left a, a snarky comment or something. And then she sent me a message telling me she hopes that I get it soon. And I was like, oh my God, that's coming for me. What are you sending me? And, um, I asked her not to tell me, but I didn't ask for anything. So this was, this was just her doing. She saw these things and she knew I would love doing, using them. And I am beyond happy that she sent them. So she sent me... Uh, we'll do this afterwards. She sent me two stamps and two dies. These are from Stamp Anything, A-N-N-I-E. I will leave a link for them down below also. This is Michael and Ryan. And this is Margaret, Margaret, Margart and Angela. M-A-R-G-A-R-T. Cool name, I thought it was Margaret, but it's not. So she sent me the stamps and the matching dies uh, for me to use for my equity and LGBT cards and for Pride Month. And then she sent me this, which I really love. This is a set by Reverse Confetti. Reverse Confetti was one of my favorite companies of all time. Um, sadly, they're no longer in business and it, I just, I never even saw the set when it was out. So I, she sent me this stamp in the die, love this. And I'm gonna be using this uh, for something new that I'm gonna be doing. So Misty and I, we tried this last year for one month and then a lot of personal things happened and we just put it off until this year. She and I are going to start on February 14th, uh, an equality for all craft collaboration. Um, she will be posting on her social media pages, probably a video on her YouTube channel. I will post to my Instagram and my blog and Facebook and maybe a YouTube video, who knows? Um, but she and I are going to do a monthly, we think a monthly craft collaboration to support the I want to say LGBT community, but it's really going to be, we're trying to support equality. We believe that everyone should be treated equal, whether you're white, black, Asian, uh, Indian, person of color, doesn't matter what your nationality is, doesn't matter what language you speak, doesn't matter what, how you identify, everyone should be treated with equality and respect uh, unless for some reason they hurt you or they hurt your children or they hurt your pets, okay? Then it's a different story. But I really can't wrap my head around the fact that people feel that they are somehow better than someone else just because they're white or they're Catholic or, you know, their they're English is their first language. It just it boggles my mind. So um, there's so much inequality and hatred in the world globally, even here in Brazil, and we just want to try to do a little bit to make a difference. And we hope at some point maybe 
the cards that we make, um, auctioning them off to raise money for a charity. So if you uh, support that also, and you are a crafter, and you would like to join us on the 14th, doesn't have to be for February, you can start the next month. We have a Facebook page that we opened up for everyone, so I will put that down below also. But if you would like to join us, it doesn't have to be a card. It could be, um, I don't know, it could be a candle. It could be um, a folio. It could be an album. It could be, I don't know what, it could be a piece of jewelry. Uh, if you would like to join us, leave a comment or uh, send me an email. Um, I'll leave my information below. And we'd love to have you along, okay? Um, that's about it. And... <laughs> Again, don't hate me, don't hate me, don't hate me for using AliExpress. There are some really good deals on AliExpress, especially if you're a crafter and you wanna buy in bulk. Um, and, but the other stuff, totally not again, not for it, not for it at all. Uh, it's put a lot of friends out of business that I know, which really affected businesses globally, even ours here. I won't even go into it, but that is it. Um, Mary, if you're watching this, I will hopefully talk to you soon. It would be great to catch up. And uh, Karen, I will be getting a postcard off to you soon. I hope so. Um, I am working on something that would be kind of cool as a postcard. But I have to finish coloring this. And you know I will. But that might work as a postcard. We'll see. Um, anyway, thank you so much, guys. Let me know what you think of what I got. Uh, and don't forget to subscribe, hit that bell button to be notified when I have another video out. And I will talk to you soon. Peace out, everyone. Stay safe.